All right, guys, I'm so excited. My giant box from Briar just arrived. This is going to be my main box. I think this includes my special runs and my swag. Um, unfortunately, it is already kind of partially open. I don't know what was going on, but I'm so excited um, to finally get my special runs. It's been almost five weeks since Briarfest, and they just now arrived. Um, I have one more package coming in tomorrow, I believe, and that has the crystal horse and then my stickers that I got from the Briar website. So I'm going to go ahead and just unbox them. I'm so excited. And I can't wait to see if I got any variations. I'm really hoping at the very least for the hollow Uffington. So um, I'm really excited to see what I got. Lots of paper, more paper. Literally half the box is of paper. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, this is... Okay. Oh my god. I can already see what the first horse is. Oh my god. I got the very Asian Ansel. Oh my god. Okay. So this one's Ansel first. I can already see through the bag that I already got the variation. I was not happy about getting Ansel. He was like on the, my very bottom list. But the blue color is my favorite. And oh my gosh, I got the variation. I'm so happy. I can't wait to see him in person. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my gosh, this horse. Holy crap. Oh my gosh, he's so pretty! What the heck? Briar, not uh Oh my gosh, so here he is, and he is absolutely beautiful. I am so happy to have this variation. Um, wow. I love him so much more than the roan or gray or whatever he was. He's so pretty oh my gosh i'm so obsessed i'm gonna put him there we'll see what others i have in here okay so my crystal did show up so i guess we'll open him next i'm really hoping he didn't break because i know a lot of people have been having issues with him breaking I love his box. His box is really nice. All right, so here he is in his box. And this is my very first crystal too, so I'm super excited. Oh, and he is perfect. He's so pretty, guys. I love him. Man, he does not disappoint. He's so, so beautiful. So I'm glad I have him. Put him back. All right. My next one is Uppington. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this is just a normal Uppington, but that's okay. He's so pretty. Let's see. This is my first one on the mold. I think this is most people's first on the mold. But super excited. I love this color too, so I'm kind of happy that I got the original because his coloring is so unique. Oh my goodness, he's gorgeous. He is long, oh my goodness. I knew people said he was long, but I really wasn't expecting him to be this long. Oh my goodness, he's so pretty. Wow. Okay, so here's Mr. Uppington, and he is so pretty. He's got super pretty blue eyes. 
Wow, and his shading. Mine actually seems pretty decent. Um, he does have kind of like a red spot on his hip, but he's really nice, so I can't complain too much. Super pretty. All right. Now on to my surprise models. Yes, I do know what mold it is, and I'm super excited for them. All right, so this is surprise number one. And of course, it's my least favorite. Okay. So this one is the Roan, just the regular Roan. He is literally my least favorite. Um, next to, I really don't like the champagne one either. He's just not my color. But this guy just looks too much like Pepto Boom Small for me. So, but he's pretty. <laughs> <laughs> Wonderful, Briar. Thank you. Okay, this guy's not too bad. He looks really nice. Um, but yeah, he does look a lot like Pepto Boom Small. So, eh, I don't know. His Ronin is actually really nice. He's actually one of the nicer Ronins that I've seen. I actually think he's a little bit better than Pepto Boom Small in that aspect. Um, but he does have like black marks on his tail. I don't know if you guys can really see it there, but yeah. So that's surprise number one. All right, and surprise number two, hoping for something a little different. I'm really hoping for either the deco or um, the pinto, the all pinto one. And of course, Briar sends me two of the same one. Oh, good lord. Just my luck. Because I got a blue uh, anvil. They're going to send me two of the exact same one. And of course, he is matte as well. Because why wouldn't he be? Well, come on. And that is Matt Roan surprise number two. So one of these guys is gonna be for sale. Um, so yeah, I got two of the same exact surprises. So one of them will be for sale or trade. I'm specifically looking for um, literally any other color <laughs> except the um, bay or the champagne or whatever. Um, I would love the Pintaloosa. I will happily trade one of these guys for the Pintaloosa or the, um, sorry. So I happily trade him for either the Pintaloosa or what was the other one? The deco or the um, matte roan, so, or the pinto roan. So yeah, that is pretty much my haul. Um, unfortunately, my kaleidoscope and my swag did not show up in this one, so I'm thinking about showing up in my box tomorrow. And I still, nope, still no Briar Fest magnet, so hopefully that comes in my box tomorrow too. Um, but yeah, no, unfortunately, he is not glossy. I got two of the exact same one because my luck ran out on getting the blue Ansel. So yeah, two Matt Rooms. Like I said, one of them will be for trade or sale. I don't know. So yeah, there are those two boys. I'll give you one last look at Uppington. And then my Bloubadour. He's so pretty. So yeah.
Alrighty guys, so my very last Briar Fest box showed up today. I believe this should be my kaleidoscope and the rest of my swag. So let's open it up and see who is inside or what is inside or what the heck is going on. the sticker sheet here's my uh, Josie hooded t-shirt a horse of a different color bag and here is my kaleidoscope I'm gonna see if there's a magnet in here because oh and there's my little label pen Let's open up the kaleidoscope and we will see what he looks like. This is really hard to do one handed by the way. Sorry, my video sorry, my video stopped there for a second. But here is kaleidoscope. I don't really collect stable mates anymore, but I do get the stable mates model every year. Decorator model that we do for And here is Kaleidoscope. Oh my goodness, he's so cute. And he's so nice. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm really happy with mine. He's so cute. I love him. He goes really well with my blue bedore, my blue Ansel. So I'm super excited to have him. Oh my goodness. I love that. He does have some like weird blue shading there. Uh, and here, I don't know what's going on there. But um, he's a really cool variation. I actually like him a lot. So yay. He's actually a lot smaller than I thought he would be. Last year's was kind of big compared to him. So he's super cute though. I'm really happy I got him. Alrighty. So here is today's haul. I love this shirt. I think it's so cute and I can't wait to see my glossy Josie when she comes in December. I also pre-ordered a glossy Apollo. So I'm super excited to get those two. There's the little label pin. I got one last year too and I actually really like these. So, And then of course, a kaleidoscope, the tote bag, and then the stickers. Um, so I still have a couple models coming in. I have my other Uffington and then I have traded my Roan, one of my Roan surprise models for a Pentalusa so that guy should be coming and then I also purchased the Sabino uh, so I'm super excited to be getting those guys but I'm just going to end my Briarfest haul here so yeah that is that. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed this haul this year. I know it's a little bit different than last year. Not everything came in at once, unfortunately, so it was kind of broken up. But I hope you guys still enjoyed it, and I hope you guys had a wonderful Barrio Fest as well. Thank you. See you next time.